Hey guys, Matt here with Carolina Coops, and today we are in upstate New York, right in our shop. And right now I'm in our shipping and receiving room. And the purpose for this video is we get a lot of questions. What is the difference between a panelized coop and a kit coop? And we completely understand it's very confusing. So I thought I would just show a little bit of behind the scenes, if you will, uh, to try to demonstrate what a kit coop is and what a panelized coop is. So on this table right here is a couple kit coops. And these are getting ready to be shipped out. And as you can see, they're just all the pieces. Everything's numbered, everything's cut, everything's notched, pre-drilled, everything. This is gonna make up a Carolina coupe. But again, this is in kit form. You save a lot of money because you're gonna assemble the entire thing. Now, if you come back here with me, and here's an example itself. In the kit coupe, all the screen, you're putting everything on. So that, that's the idea behind the kit coupe. But over here, uh, we have on a wrapper, I think it's going out to Alabama. Uh, this is a panelized coupe. Same exact coupe, but we did 90% of the work. So if you're thinking about buying a panelized coupe, this is how it would come to you. Turn this around. It's on a big A-frame. Uh, no, we got a bunch of hemp back there, so we can't turn it. Um, industrial they, hemp. Industrial hemp, yeah. The, the stuff you're going to put in for the deep litter system. Um, so these are the walls. Actually, you know what? Let's head out here. I'll show you another example of the panelized version. So again, that's your kit. We'll come out to the main shop area. Okay, so actually here are some more good examples. Uh, and if you're thinking about buying the panelized coupe, okay, versus the kit coupe, the other big question we get a lot is what sizes? And we got actually three different examples here. Uh, over here is a, is a coupe in process being panelized. This is, uh, I think it's one going out to Missouri. And this one's eight foot wide. And we can ship that anywhere in the country. It's split right in half. Again, all comes to you all in panels. Now, our clients out in California, New York City, New Jersey, a lot of those areas that don't have a lot of room, they like the smaller coops. Uh, still huge compared to those pieces of crap coops you get from China. Uh, but we can custom make them any size you want. And here's an example of a much smaller, uh, let's see, this is a four by, this is a four by 18 going out to California. Getting ready to be shipped. I think we're just finishing up a couple things. Um, we're using some French doors for the run. So this is one door. And uh, but again, it's in panels. So that's how it comes to shipped. And actually, if we turn around here, here's another example. Uh, here's a coupe going out. Where's this one going to? We don't even know. But it's going somewhere in America, I'm sure, or Canada. It's going to this one's going to California. Thank you, whoever bought it in California. Um, another panelized coupe. Maybe you come around here, I can't spin this one, but you can give an example how it comes to you. Because that's the other big question is, well, how's it going to come to me? We actually custom make our own pallets, our own A-frames. So and there's a vertical column in here that all the walls rest against. It's wrapped, it's strapped, it's perfect. It comes to you on a tractor trailer. And actually, if you come back over here, this is another example of a Cooper Labs, California. They all have a lot of room. They really want to give their girls as much room as possible. Here's just a custom 4x18. Not finished, obviously, but it's the back penthouse area. And actually, here's a, here's a neat little thing that you don't see a lot with our coops. We actually ended up putting the A-cutch on the back door. It just worked out good for the client uh, because of the restricted area uh, for space. But it's uh, attached to the back penthouse door, just kind of slick. If you come around here, you can get an idea. Um, there'll be a little perch bar here that the chickens go in and lay their eggs, but you still have full easy access for cleaning, and then the deep litter door, all high density polyethylene. So again, the point of this video is just hopefully explain a little bit more behind the scenes of what is the difference between a, a panelized coop, which can be customized any way you want, or our standard kit coop. If you have any questions, call me. If you're watching right now, my number will come up. Hey, you know what? Maybe I'll put it on right now. Hopefully you see it. Call me, I'll answer the phone. Thanks for watching.